think that when the de-escalation at the embassy happened a couple of days ago, that was the end of this chapter. The United States, with its firmness, had won the victory. It wasn't going to be Benghazi. It wasn't going to be, uh, you know, uh, Tehran from 1980. Uh, we won that technical victory. Now we have taken this huge military escalation. Now, I fear the worst, you're going to see the Bravo. U.S. markets go crazy today. You're going to see the price of oil spiking Bravo. today. This is a very, very big deal. And I don't know if you, you heard, but this isn't about his resume of blood and death. It is about what was next. We stopped the next attack. It was preemptive. That's what I think you're missing. According to the Secretary of State. And, and, so and we by, should allow by, the next by attack? What, by what credible source okay. can you predict what the next Iranian right. move the would Secretary be? The Secretary of State, State and State. American Intelligence well, provided I, that material. Yeah, they've been excellent. They've been excellent. The U.S. Uh, intelligence has been excellent since 2003 when we invaded Iraq, disrupted the entire region for no real reason. Don't for a minute start cheering this on. What you have done, what we have done, we have unleashed... I will cheer it on. We have... All right, I will well, cheer you, it on. Then you, I like Lazy Graham, I'm, I'm have never lady. made a war you didn't like. That is I, not true, if, and, and don't even say that. If, if President Trump wanted de-escalation... We should just let him kill us for another 15 years. If President years. Trump wanted de-escalation to bring our troops home, what this was a reaction to... What about to, the 700 Americans that are dead? Should they not be happy? You know... Because of him? What about, what about the tens of thousands of Iraqis who have died since two 2003. You have to start seeing things. What, okay. what the hell are we doing in Baghdad to, in the first place? So you why, are, why are we you, there? You, blaming, why aren't these forces on? You're blaming President Bush for the maniacal I am blaming President Bush. Hussein? I am blaming President Bush in 2003 for those fake weapons of mass destruction right. he, that he, never existed oh and the right. con job Geraldo, that drove please. us into that war. Geraldo, uh, I think there's a disagreement here at the desk on uh, all of that.